Hi everyone, welcome to another Monday Wrap. My name is Ian Laxon and we are going to get straight into performance of the week. Uh, loads of cricket over the weekend. It was a full two day round um, for Premier Cricket and heaps of runs out there as well. Some big hundreds over the weekend. 151 for uh, Rob McConaughey for, for Birkenhead. Jacob Kurt, sorry, 129 for Rob, 151 for Jacob Kirtling. Uh, and Birkenhead's huge 400 plus total. Uh, Brad Schmulian, 114 for East Coast Bays. And uh, Rhys Young, the top of those, 176 for Suburbs and they're outright over Papatoe. Um, bowlers not to be left out as well. Uh, also some five wicket bags around. Aaron uh, Watson for Takapuna. Darren Eckford, five for 24. Another five wicket bag for him. Raj Sandhu, six for 45. And also uh, in schools cricket uh, for McLean's. Fantastic effort. Um, Kay Dogra, seven for 33. Outstanding performance, and not forgetting, of course, Cheat Raval's 100 for the Aces um, before the weekend. But we're going to give performance of the week uh, for a huge 100 that set up uh, suburbs for the first outright win of the season in Premier Cricket, uh, Rhys Young. Great to see him amongst the runs again, so uh, well played, Rhys. Now, speaking of, Rhys is obviously a former Ace, and stopping straight into the Aces segue there. Uh, tough week for them last week. Uh, that first day really put paid in many ways to their chances. They fought back really well in that game against Canterbury, but on the last day, couldn't get those wickets. Canterbury went uh, and got the outright win. But still some great performances in there. Jeet Raval, his second century of the season already, so he's in really good form. Michael Bates coming back into the side, picking up a, a four-wicket bag, and fantastic to see uh, Martin Guptill out there and scoring runs. He hit 85 in that second dig for the Aces. So plenty of positives to take out of that. And uh, they've like now got a break this week. They're playing a couple of 2020 warm-up games tomorrow on Tuesday and then they've got their first HRV 2020 game down in the capital on Saturday nights against the Firebirds. So really looking forward to that HRV starting to build up. We're only a couple of weeks away from our games out there on the number one, the 29th and the 30th. Don't forget those ones. And looking forward to seeing how that whole Aces and uh, Firebird mascot thing goes. Uh, our Maverick taking on the Firebird. I think we've got that one covered. Uh, what else is going on? We've got an A game uh, happening from tomorrow against ND out at Lloyd Ellsmore Park. That's a three-day game out there, so good luck um, to all the guys who have been selected in that. Let's get off to a winning start. There's some other rep cricket going on out there as well. The under-15 uh, girls district tournament starts this Sunday and goes on over the, the next few weeks as well. So heaps of cricket. We're really getting into it now. District tournaments are not getting far away. Um, so, yeah, exciting stuff. Good luck uh, to the Aces uh, in Wellington this Saturday and also to those A boys in the game starting tomorrow. That's the Monday wrap for this week. We will catch you next Monday.